Hello, hello, it's Brandy Janae here. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel today. In today's video, I am going to be unboxing this cloth and paper subscription box. So be sure to stay tuned. Okay, thank you guys so, so, so much for joining me today. If you are new here, then I would like to welcome you to my channel. And if you are a returning subscriber, then I would like to say thank you for all of your continued support. I truly, truly appreciate it. I know that you guys saw another cloth and paper video that I did recently where I said I was no longer getting the Pinspiration box. Well, I decided to go ahead and get the regular sub box because I have this new pocket planner and I am absolutely in love with it. And so I wanted some really cool cloth and paper pocket accessories. And I figured the subscription box was probably going to be the most cost effective way for me to get those supplies without having to order everything individually. So I am super excited to get this first cloth and paper subscription box to see what inside is inside. I don't really remember how much this box costs. I think it's 30 something, but I don't really remember. Um, so be sure to check out Cloth and Paper's website so that you can um, you know, check out the, the subscription boxes for yourself. They do have the Pinspiration box by itself. And then they also have the planner box um, that you can get in the particular planner size that you have. Um, and then you can also get a combination of both. So um, yeah, anyway, let's go ahead and see what is inside. All right, so what's inside? Dashboards, inserts, a reusable pouch, circle sticky note set, spotlight page flags, travel label stickers, and then journaling cards. So I am super duper excited about this. Um, it looks like this is kind of, it says for visual reference only, so we'll see. But yeah, I'm excited. I needed some happy mail today. Life has been very rough around here. We've suffered a couple deaths this summer. So we're just, uh, anything happy right now that I can do is just right on time because it's it's been rough around here in this house. Um, so if you are a praying person, please, please, please shoot up a prayer for my family as we deal with all of our losses and funerals that will be coming up um, between August and September. Um, so anyway, this is the little zipper pouch and it is so cute. I don't have any idea what it's for because obviously this does not go in the pocket planner but it is precious. I might actually start using it to hold my inserts in, my extra ones, that is so cute. And I wonder, I don't have my pocket in here with me, but I almost kind of wonder if it would fit <laughs> in here. It might actually fit in this little pouch. Let me see, does it say? Reusable pouch, the perfect companion for all of your summer events is equally at home housing toiletries, pens, or sticky notes, not to mention it pairs perfectly with our new CMP vanity cases. Okay, so yeah, it's just a little pouch. So I might actually use it to store my extra um, inserts um, because I'm always looking for a nice place to put them. And this will be cool because I'll be able to see that the inserts are in here so I won't have to wonder where did I put those inserts again? Um, we have this little dashboard, I love it. I saw that my life was a vast glowing empty page and I could do anything I wanted. So that is super cute. I love the frosted, so I can't wait to add that into my planner. And then this is, oh, the traveling card. So here's the traveling card, super cute. Then we have, ooh, some daily itinerary inserts. So these must be the um, traveling, yeah. Um, pocket daily itinerary inserts. So it looks like this whole box is kind of a traveling type box. So that's exciting. I can definitely use these pages when I'm getting ready to head out on some sort of trip. So here's our daily itinerary. It has a spot for weather, things to do, meals, and then notes. And it's the same on the back. So you get quite a few pages of those, which is awesome. love the travel theme. 
Then there's also a packing list. So it has your essentials, clothing, toiletries, technology, and shoes. Super awesome. You all, I always like to make a good tra um, traveling list, packing list, especially for not necessarily my things, but more or less so that I can remember to pack my husband's things because uh, you know how men are when it comes to packing. Not all men, <laughs> but most men. So it's nice to have those things written down so that I don't forget. Um, then we have our September 2021 Horizontal Weekly for September. I love the S, that's cute. I apologize if you guys hear music in the background. Apparently my neighbor decided he's going to DJ now, so that's fun. Um, so here is the weekly layout for this. I like it. It's different than the other weekly layouts that I have. So I do really enjoy how this looks. So that'll be a nice little change for the month. And then this back page just has a notes section. I should have brought my pocket so that I actually could stick this stuff in there, but that's okay. I will know that for next time. Cute paid flags. These are called Spotlight. It's a set of three. Um, Lagoon, Myconos, and Aspen are the names of the colors. Ah, get that out of there. Cute. Oh yeah, I really like those. So they're like the frosted page flags. This color combination is very pretty. I'm all about the neutrals, especially like in the grays. Super cute. Then we have some circle sticky notes. I love them, they're so cute. And these are not frosted, these look like the matte. Um, yeah, they're like a solid sticky note, so that's exciting. Um, Angora, Mojito, and Cypress. And you get 25 sets of each, and I absolutely adore these greens. Beautiful, 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 more neutral tones, which is my jam. Then we have these travel stickers. So you get 18 transparent stickers, which is nice. I wonder, well, they look like they might be too big for the, yeah, they're definitely too big for the list, but they might be cool to um, label like your bags and things. I'm not sure, but I like them. I'll figure out what to do with them. Um, and then we have, Um, this little September card, which is cute. I don't know why my camera is not focusing on that very well. Let's see. Okay, so it's like a September little card. Cute. I see a lot of people put these just in like a little pocket as a reference. And then we have this um, September card. It's blank on the back. To create something exceptional, your mind must be focused on the smallest detail. So that's cute. That's by Giorgio Armani. And then you still have a lot of time to make yourself be what you want. And that is S.E. Hinton. So more like uh, little journal cards. So yeah, I am super excited. I love everything in this box and I am so excited to be able to add them into my pocket for September. Um, and I look forward to seeing what is in future boxes um, just to kind of, you know, spice things up and keep everything fresh in my planner. So that'll be super cool. So thank you guys again so much for watching. Again, I truly appreciate your support and you guys all have a good day. Goodbye.